A high school student in Texas is receiving high marks and a lot of attention for his latest test score. And that's what we're checking out in today's Hawaiian Telecom social scene. Jaden Swearingen from Round Rock High School got a perfect score of 36 on the ACT. And unlike the SAT test, it includes a science section. Now, getting a perfect score on the ACT means needing a broader level of knowledge, and it's even more impressive considering how learning was disrupted due to the pandemic. I think it was good for me. I think I had a lot more free time, with, and I had more time to study and practice things. Now, Swearingen hopes to turn his perfect score into a scholarship. And by the way, the average score on the ACT is... 21. But kudos to this teenager who is all smiles and rightfully so because to get a perfect score. Yeah, but if I was him and I got a perfect score of 36, I wouldn't just be standing there. I would be doing cartwheels <laughs> on yeah. campus, back and forth. I, I'd be the same. I'd be running around with the paper. I got 36. <laughs> what did you get? <laughs> but you did pretty well. You did really well on the ACT when you took it. I, I, I think I got a 23. Mm -hmm. I want to say 33, but that just sounds too high for me. But a 23, because I remember it was Michael Jordan. So I got Michael Jordan, but I should have been Larry Bird and got 33. I'd be smarter. But he must have uh, tons of offers. Now, if you got a perfect yeah. ACT score, Jaden, People can call you up and be like, hey, can you help me study? Yeah, and I, I read like 36, of course, is just, it's so rare that the amount of people who get a perfect score of 36, it's 0.03% of the students who take it get a perfect score of 36. That's and how rare it is. Yeah, it was rare to get a 23 back in the day too, because <laughs> it was harder back then. You just know what? <laughs> I didn't even take the SAT, Ross, so. You know what? You're one up on me on there. I just took the SAT and I did not do good.